Listen, man. If we being fair, if we being fair, others, bro. Steph Curry is better than LeBron James. And, and Jeff Van Gundy proved another point tonight that I got that y'all will see. Oh man, that's crazy going on there. Come on, I'm trying to hear that. Listen, the way Steph Curry opened up the floodgates for his teammates, Kay Thompson was balling. Like, listen. K. Thompson's a four-time champion. Draymond Green's a Hall of Famer. A guy that probably will be in the D-League right now in this, this time in his, his career. Uh, just another guy on a different team is a Hall of Famer. K. Thompson should have been a top 75 player because Steph Curry. He got snubbed. K. Thompson had put in more work in the zero top 75 spot than Anthony Davis. That's how I said it. Uh, making Steve Kerr a Hall of Fame coach. Building that culture. Making y'all favorite, some of y'all favorite players, Skill Bailey's favorite player, Kevin Durant, a champion. Stopping LeBron James from winning five, six, seven, eight championships. That's Steph Curry. Steph Curry is the engine that go, make everything go. And let's talk about his game. He's a better shooter. He, revolu he revolutionized the way you play basketball. Everybody want to be like Steph. Everybody wants to shoot the three. The bigs, the stretch fold, the stretch centers, the guard, the young guys at the 24 finish, the AAU team. Everybody shoot threes with the handles. Everybody in the NBA shoot threes. Because of Steph, he got the center eliminated from basketball. Because of Steph. The, them times of Shaq, Alonzo Morning, Tim Duncan, Carl Malone. Patrick Hearn, back to the basket type guys. Slow the game down. That game is over with because of Steph Curry. And it's beautiful to watch sometimes. But I don't like to see people shoot threes all day long. I like to see some memory. I like to see some post up. I like to see that. But that's all because of Steph Curry. The winning. The back-to-back -back MVP. unanimous MVP. He got that on his resume like LeBron. LeBron had four. Steph got two. Final championship, final piece of stuff, got it. Steph a better shooter, better free throw shooter, better handle, better score, a better team player. Build a dynasty where he got drafted at. Made people actually better in Hall of Famers while LeBron James joined, joined and built super teams with top 75 and Hall of Fame players. Guys, what are we talking about here? If we really be honest, now if we want to say LeBron James 6'9", 260, can he beat LeBron James one-on-one -on -one and one-on-one game? Hell no, absolutely not. Can LeBron James in an NBA game guard LeBron James? Absolutely not. But it's more things that Steph Curry do on the basketball court and for the NBA and his team that will say Steph Curry is better than him. I'm, I'm tired of high behind the media behind because he's 6'9", 260. Steph Curry... Took Andrew Wiggins, a guy that LeBron James said, I'm not going back to Cleveland, left y'all. Flip Andrew Wiggins for uh, Kevin Love that's having 26 and 15, 13 for the Minnesota Timberwolves. He said, I ain't going back to Cleveland. I got, we got Curry. They got no one pick, but I need, I need Wiggins to flip. And four, five years later, Steph Curry made that man an all-star and an NBA champion. Come on, man. Y'all don't hear me. Y'all don't hear me. LeBron James, y'all don't hear me, bro. What he do on the court? For his teammate. Assuming he, assuming he cross, cross half court. The floor is spread. It. The defense is committed to him. When he run off screens, two dudes running him. Giving guys open pin downs. Laying to the basket. Laying cutters. Slashes all the way to the rim. When you in a Steph Curry or a Kobe Brown or Michael Jordan offense. What you can do as a player. The floor gets spread and the defense gets shifted to your way. Where it's so much attention on you. Well, you can make your own move. You can cut to the basket. You can take an angle and roll, roll to the basket. Or you can get open four. You get open three point shot. Well, LeBron James, you gotta sit in the corner and wait till he finishes passing the ball and say, "Yeah, I'm gonna pass it to you." Go ahead and shoot that three with the shot clock running down. That's never made nobody better, bro. That's never made, creating offense for others all the time doesn't, doesn't make them better. And what I mean when I say this, I want y'all pay attention with Steph, Kobe, and uh, Jordan. They will position themselves on the court where defense have to come to them in, in certain positions of the floor and bring attention to them so much where your, your teammates can either make a move by themselves, cut to the basket, 
or make a wide open three or make offense for other players on the team, not just stand in the corner and just shoot a three. They position themselves so where the, the defense have to help for certain ways so you can, if I step, if Kobe on the wing in the post, you on the wing, you can either pump fake to the basket and draw all the way to the basket or you can drop it off to your teammate. The position that they take on the floor to help their teammates to get better, to make plays for others and not just they self, is reason why they are better floor generals and better players than LeBron James himself. Come on, y'all don't hear me tonight. Y'all don't hear me tonight. It's going to be a lot of people he hating on LeBron. He says stuff. Listen, he ain't a defensive player like LeBron. He tries on defense for his position. He rebound great for his position. He had six, six rebounds this season. I'm um, for a point guard. He had five. I think he five for his career. That's pretty damn good for a six-feet point guard. Last time I checked, defense the rebound is part of defense. That's how you close out a defensive possession by rebounding the basketball. He do a damn good job of defense. He moves his feet. He tries on defense. LeBron James not a great on ball defender. We can kill that narrative right now. I mean, Melo, KD, Kobe, Steph Curry, D Wade. Before he joined D Wade, was giving LeBron James the business. Paul George was giving him the business. Kawhi Leonard can give him the business. He like he get the business done to him by wing like talented players. He only, he only got this narrative because he was guarding Tiago split up, blocking his shot in the paint, and he was, and he shut down Derrick Rose, a guard that can't shoot. All he do is drive to the basket. LeBron James got great recovery speed, so he can, D Rose can roll by out, and LeBron takes all his shot to the rim by blocking it, or alternating at the rim because he got length and size, and he, LeBron quick. But can he sit down and guard a perimeter play? Jay Terry disposed him in the finals. He couldn't guard JJ Barrea in the finals. I mean, it's ridiculous the narrative that he can guard all one through five like he's a great defender. He's no, you're not. Steph Curry is better than this man. Put some respect on Steph Curry's name. I said it. I stand by it. Agree, disagree, disagree if you want to. Put your comments below. I might, I, I, I might, I might respond. Like, subscribe. I'm out.